Dobro veče, ladies and gentlemen. So, if you haven't seen this thing already that's flying around YouTube, this so-called movie called The Innocence of Muslims. This is a vile movie insulting Muslims, and it's just a really bad movie. Like I can't even think about this movie without laughing. I, I, it's, I struggle to call it a movie. It's just a piece of shit put together to insult Muslims, and it's so badly made. The acting is terrible and it's just an all round stupid movie but do you know what I find even more dumber and vile than the movie itself is the reaction to the movie and these riots are started in Cairo and, and Lebanon they, because of this movie and I wasn't even going to talk about this thing but I started getting messages over the weekend about um, look what your Muslim brothers and sisters are doing I've said this once before, but I'll say it again. I'm not a Muslim, I'm not a Christian. I'm just a human being that's sick of these monstrosities that I keep on seeing. And there's two monstrous things that happened over last week. One, this vile movie, and two, the vile reaction to this movie. Now, I understand that people are upset. And rightly so, it should be upset. It should be upset, but it shouldn't be anything beyond just, wow, these people are idiots, what the fuck are they talking about? This movie wasn't exactly some intellectual critique on, on, on Islam, it was just like a movie with no factual basis, throwing insults here and there, the actors weren't even aware of what the movie was about, you can see lines have been dubbed over and it was, oh, I don't have words, I'm struggling to explain how bad this film is and I'm not going to show clips of this in this of this film in my video because your computer might crash that's how bad it is regardless of how disrespectful or insulting this movie is I'm disappointed at the reaction to it because it's like this movie was saying more or less you know Muslim people are animals and that's how it really betrays them like violent animals like, and then most people have gone and acted like violent animals they hit up a US embassy did some people need to die over this movie <laughs> this so called movie Let's be real, like somebody needs to come out here and say enough is enough, what is going on? I've, people have told me, oh, the US government needs to come out and make an apology. One moron comes out and makes a movie and so what, he's speaking for the whole of America? Like I'm somebody who's criticised um, American policy, American foreign policies and this and that. But uh, let, let's, let's be realistic, let's be honest here. One idiot who makes a, a, a film about Muslims doesn't represent the whole of America. Like the American government need to come out and make an apology. What about the people who stormed the embassy and killed people? They hit up a KFC in Lebanon. What did KFC do to you? What K what's KFC got to do with this so-called movie? The innocence of Muslims. This film was so bad. Like I I'm, to be honest with you, I laughed when I watched it. I couldn't believe it. Like I, I didn't laugh because the content was funny in the context of what it was saying it was just so bad that I was like is this serious are they thinking like people are going to take this seriously I said yeah whatever man and people took it seriously wow here's the thing here's the thing you can't you can't complain about people stereotyping you that you're a terrorist and you're in this and that when the moment that you're poked you react in that way that you're stereotypically described. How does that make sense? That's like, this, this the reaction to this movie is, is, is almost like me saying, you know what, I'm tired of people saying that I'm a criminal, I'm a thug, I'm tired of it. And then I walk down the street and then some woman looks at me funny and I say, yo, bitch, give me your handbag. Snatch the handbag away and then go back to crying about, I'm tired of people saying that I'm a thug. And what? Somebody said to me, Oh, um, you need to understand that it's like somebody um, disrespecting if I your 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 mother or your family or any remember that my mother, father, sister, brother, like, listen, the whole family was what if I insulted them? Yo, somebody that I don't really know that well insults somebody in my family, I'm gonna look at you like you're an idiot. Because what are you talking about? And that, and this these people don't obviously don't know that much about Islam and because like I said, there was no factual points made in this movie. Even though it was supposed to be an intellectual critique on Islam, it clearly wasn't. 
there's no factual point to this movie, they're just throwing childish insults. So somebody throws a childish insult about my family, but I'm going to laugh in their face and say, what the fuck are you talking about? I had other comparisons, people saying, oh, what if uh, you, you got called a, a nigger, is that okay? People have been following my YouTube from when it, let's say, became a more relevant channel on, on YouTube, then you will probably know the reasons why I get a lot of death threats and racial insults and whatnot. Uh, but I don't go around saying, okay, I'm going to go and kill people because of this. Or I'm going to go and attack an embassy of where these people come from. No, not really. Like, that doesn't make any logical sense. You can't compare somebody insulting your race or your family to your religion. I don't care how devoted you are to your religion. That's a choice, that's a path that you've chosen to follow. I can't change the fact that I'm a black guy. I can't change who, who my family is. So if you insult me about my race or my family, maybe a physical reaction, I don't say it's warranted, but it's more legitimate. Either way, it's still not okay, but it's more legitimate. So I'm not buying, I'm not buying that whole, that whole thing that you can't compare it to anything like that. This, people are arguing. I mean, what is? What, people are arguing over religion. This this stuff has been going on since the dawn of time. I wonder when people will wake up. Yeah, I'm tired of talking about this shit already. I'm just gonna show you my reaction to it. Yeah, that's it. Fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> So bad, like they did it on purpose, bro. They did it like on there's, there's, there's clear they, parts they where they, to be shit. like these actors have said something else and then just put like Muhammad over uh, the top. <laughs> I don't see it. You can't take this seriously. The movie's not even good. It's like it's not even a B-rate movie. It's well, like it's a C-rate movie. Bro. Z rate <laughs> It's terrible. We don't condone the violence, but we also don't condone the film. Well, if you watched the film, it actually it's, it's quite difficult to be offended by it because it's quite difficult to take it seriously.